Welcome to uh, Hello, welcome to the meeting, special meeting of the Yale School Committee, Tuesday, May 25th. Uh, can I have a roll call vote, please? Frank, you want to try that again? It went in and out a little bit. Case. Um, tonight is uh, it's Tuesday, May 25th. Committee. You're still in and out. Tom. I am here. Uh, I'm having um, audio problems. Uh, would you mind sharing the meeting tonight? Yes, you are having audio problems. Can you chair the meeting? Sure. Okay. Oh. I'm, I'm going to really relinquish my uh, my seat over to Ms. Tapaze, who will chair tonight's special meeting. Thank you. Okay. I don't know why. Why am I only seeing certain people? Okay, let me change my view. Hold on. Gallery view. All right, there's everybody. Hi, everybody. It's hey, like old time. This is like old times. Okay, um, let's see. On. We are live uh, already. What happened? Cynthia was just letting you know that we're live. Don't ever have to let me know that it's live. Anything I say is for total public consumption, believe me, no matter what it is. No filter here. Uh, all right, Addy, I guess uh, we begin with uh, roll call. Ms. Tabrizé. Here. Mr. Barrows. Ms. Cardello. Here. Ms. Lambert. Present. Ms. Murray. Here. Mr. LaMonica. Mr. Panarisi. Here. Here. Ms. Sarney. Here. Mr. Parker. Here. Ms. Dinah Lewis. Here. All right, so I've oh, got three, I'm five, sorry. Um, six, I'm sorry. seven. I've got uh, 70. Mayor um, Di Maria, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's okay. So we've got eight members. We have a quorum. Um, I don't know if you have a flag, but uh, let's begin by uh, saluting the flag. How's that? Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United, the United States of America, America. and to, to the, the republic, republic which, is which stands, stands one nation, one nation under God, God, God indivisible, indivisible with liberty and justice, justice for all. Okay, let's see. Uh, but first, we have uh, reading of the records. Um, Mr. Chairman, there's no record to be read. There's no records. Okay, so we're going on right to the uh, uh, special portion of the meeting. Oh, are we doing public comment? Yeah. Okay. So I'll entertain a motion to uh, open up for public comment. So moved. Second. Motion made and seconded to open up public comment. Uh, roll call vote, please. Mr. Abrazé? Yes. Mr. Barrows? Ms. Cardello? Yes. Mayor Di Maria? Yes. Ms. Lambert? Yes. 
Miss Murray? Yes. Mr. Panarisi? Yes. Miss Sarney? Yes. Mr. Parker? Yes. Eight in the affirmative. Uh, public comment is now open. Uh, do we have any uh, one ready for public comment, uh, Addy? We don't have anyone in queue right now. Okay. Make a motion to close public comment. Second. Okay, so we're not going to wait. All right, motion made and seconded to close public comment. Uh, roll call vote, please, Addy. Mr. Abrazé? Yes. Mr. Barrows? Ms. Cardello? Yes. Mayor Di Maria? Yes. Ms. Lambert? Yes. Ms. Murray? Yes. Mr. Panarisi? Yes. Ms. Sarney? Yes. Mr. Parker? Yes. All right, in the affirmative, so negative public comment is closed. All right. Um, I lost my agenda, so I'm guessing I'm going to turn it over to uh, Superintendent Tahiliani right now. How's that? That sounds great. Thank you. Thank so, you. Uh, <laughs> so uh, item number one under the report of the superintendent is requesting approval of a statement of interest for a new roof at the Webster School. Um, on behalf of the school department, I am seeking permission to submit a statement of interest to the Massachusetts School Building Authority to replace the roof at the Webster School. At the last school committee meeting, we had actually discussed um, a number of potential capital improvement projects. Um, and we had made recommendations regarding some that we would move forward, forward with at the school department level out of our FY21 general funds as well as referring some over back to uh, the city. Um, the committee did ask that we go back and talk with the MSBA and see if there were any of those items that would be qualified under MSBA for the repairs. Um, the four items that we had approved that the body approved to come out of our FY21 general funds actually were not eligible for MSBA application anyway. So I did just wanna report back on that. Um, however, one item that was um, that was eligible that we did want to move forward with is the Webster roof um, replacement. And that was one of the items that we referred over to the city. Um, I would respectfully request to invite up Assistant Superintendent Charlie Obremski if there are any additional questions by the body of the materials that we sent over earlier. I make a motion to invite Mr. Obremski. Second. A motion was made and seconded to invite before us Mr. Bremsky. Uh, we have to do a roll call for this. We can just do thumbs, Frank. Uh, we have to do a roll call. Okay. Uh, roll call, please, Addy. Mr. Abrazé? Yes. Ms. Cardello? Yes. Mayor Di Maria? Yes. Ms. Lambert? Yes. Ms. Murray? Yes. Mr. Panarisi? Yes. Ms. Sarney? Yes. Mr. Parker? Yes. In the affirmative, uh, uh, bring before uh, Mr. Bring before us, Mr. Abramski, does uh, uh, anyone have any questions for Mr. Abramski? Uh, Ms. Lambert? Thank you, Mr. Chairman, through you to Mr. Obremski. Was it due to the age of the buildings? Because in researching the MSBA requirements, it looks like it shifted from 20 years to 30 years. When I'm looking um, through the chair to Ms. Lambert, if I may, Ms. Tapperse. Um, on conversation, the last school committee meeting that we had um, with Mr. Shaw, particularly that night, I re went back and researched the MSBA. And it looks like right now it is um, the roof would have to be more than 25 years old, the boiler more than 25 years old, and for the windows, 30 years. So I did have conversation with the next day. I did call MSBA the night after that last school committee meeting. I did contact the MSBA the next day in the Webster roof. And we are looking to do both the modules in the main building would be eligible under this program because of the age of the roof. 
We do have a um, report from the Garland company that was done in February of 2020 that the roof is in uh, need of repair. And at that time in 2020, in February, and that's about 15 months ago, um, failure is imminent within one to three years unless corrective action has taken place. The okay. reason for the expediency of this meeting and why we call the special meeting, the whole application on this period is due on June 1st, which is next Tuesday. Um, and that's why, all, I, I don't know if you're aware of this, the school committee and the people at home, but the city council is also having a special meeting tomorrow night if this is approved by this body this evening to approve this same um, MSBA project for the roof of the Webster School tomorrow evening. And I will work with the chairman, the superintendent, and the mayor to get the necessary signatures over to MSBA by Thursday or Friday. Okay. And so in just um, looking at the overall process, so it's a little bit different than the statement of interest we did for a whole school building, but it's still, once we submit it, it goes to city council and then um, goes to MSBA, MSBA and then goes to a board vote. Do we know the, the, the MSBA? I'm not sure when the next board meeting is on the MSBA and how fast the process would be. The person I've been talking to over there has been very helpful. I could call over there tomorrow, Ms. Lambert, and find out uh, when they believe this project, once they look at everything, when it might be approved and get back to you. Okay, I appreciate it. Thank you. You're welcome. Anyone else? Uh, seeing no other questions, uh, uh, I would suggest that uh, Mr. Obremski, you uh, uh, hang around just so we don't have to go through the process again of uh, bringing you back forward if you uh, don't mind. Thank you. Absolutely, Mr. Appleton. Okay. Uh, Ms. Parker. I'm um, sorry. Uh, Mr. Mr. Chairman, I'll make a motion Mr. for Parker. Make a motion for favorable action. Second. Okay, motion made and seconded for favorable action. Did I see someone? Uh, I'm sorry. Did I, did I see uh, Sam? You good? Okay. All right. Motion made and seconded for favorable action on the piece. Uh, roll call, please, Addie. Ms. Abizé? Yes. Ms. Cardello? Yes. Mayor Di Maria? Yes. Ms. Lambert? Yes. Ms. Murray? Yes. Mr. Panarisi? Yes. Ms. Sarney? Yes. Mr. Parker? Yes. Uh, in the affirmative, the motion passes. Uh, uh, back to you, Madam Superintendent. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Parker, go ahead. Uh, Mr. Chairman, um, yes. I, need to, I need to read a statement. Uh, obviously, you're in the chair, but you don't have the paperwork. So, if I can just read a statement. I'm sorry, you're going you're gonna to read a statement with your audio proof. Is any better? We might be better off posting it, Frank. Uh, yes. This is better? Okay. Yes. So, be it resolved, having convened in an open meeting on May 25th, 2021, prior to the SOI submission closing date, the school committee of Everett, in accordance with its charter, bylaws and ordinances, has voted to authorize the superintendent to submit to the Massachusetts School Building Association a statement of interest form dated May 25th, 2021, for Webster School located at 30 Dartmouth Street, which describes and explains the following deficiencies and the priority categories for which an application may be submitted to the Massachusetts School Building Authority in the future. The Webster School needs a new roof. Despite consistent repair efforts, the roof over the module classrooms in the main building continues to be. We submit the statement of interest and hereby further specifically acknowledge that by submitting this statement of interest form, the Massachusetts School Building Authority in no way guarantees the acceptance or the approval of an application, the awarding of a grant, or any other funding commitment from Massachusetts School Building Authority or commits the city, town, or regional school district to filing an application for funding with the Massachusetts School Building Authority. Thank you. You faded out at the end. I don't know if you said anything important, of course. I think most of what you say is important, but the last sentence uh, sort of left us uh, okay um, how about 
Uh, we submit this statement of interest and hereby further specifically acknowledge that by submitting this statement of interest, form, the MSBA in no way guarantees the acceptance of the approval of an application, the awarding of a grant or any other funding commitment from the Massachusetts School Building Authority or commits the city to filing an application for funding at the Massachusetts School Building Authority. Very good. I think we all heard it. We're good? Okay. All right, so uh, uh, motion was made and seconded for favorable action. Uh, roll call vote, please, Addie. Mr. Abrazé? Yes. Ms. Cardello? Yes. May Di Maria? Yes. Ms. Lambert? Yes. Ms. Murray? Yes. Mr. Panarisi? Yes. Ms. Sarney? Yes. Mr. Parker? Yes. Okay, eight in the affirmative, the motion passed. All right. Motion for adjournment, Mr. Chairman. Well, we have one more item. I was, I was gonna go back to uh, uh, Superintendent Tahiliani. Uh, go ahead, but, but Ms. Cadello. Thank you, you Mr. Me? Chairman. I don't believe we recognize that student representative tonight, Donna Lewis, I'd like to welcome her. Welcome her and thank her for being here. She's very good about coming to the meetings. So proud of her. Thank you. Thanks for having me. We recognize you, didn't we, Diane? I mean, yeah. they called my name during roll call, but. Yeah, well, when they, yeah, well, usually you get trumpets and stuff like that for the, for the student rep, like, you know, but uh, thank you, Diane. For being here, okay. Um, uh, back to uh, Superintendent Tahiliani, I think. Yes, thank you. We just have one more um, item, and so that we will be submitting that uh, to the mayor and the city council for approval. And we do want to thank the city council for having a special meeting tomorrow to discuss this matter. Um, so item number two is the approval of the Everett Public Schools Food Service Amendment. So um, this was actually an item from the last meeting that was laid on the table. Um, I am asking permission of the school committee to roll over the food service contract with Whitson's New England Incorporated. Um, this would be the last of a three-year contract. The documents were in your packet. And um, I know that we had gone back to do some additional negotiations um, uh, regarding the prices. So uh, I'm glad that we kept up uh, Assistant Superintendent Obremski because he is also here to report back or answer any questions. Um, okay, so Mr. Obremski, does anybody have any questions on the uh, status of the uh, food contract uh, negotiations or otherwise? Ms. Lambert. I just wanted to recognize Mr. Parker for calling out the um, guarantee. And I believe that is one of the items that has changed since we last saw the contract. Uh, so previously in the amendment, um, sorry, I just lost my place, but <laughs> uh, the amended amount was 500 and 25,000, and that has been increased uh, 158,000 to 683,000. Uh, so that's the CAFE revolving fund. Uh, so thank you for catching that. And thank you for Mr. Obremski and the administration for going back to the table on that item. Very good, yes. Motion for favorable action. Second a motion. All right, motion made and seconded for favorable action. Uh, any more? Uh, Discussion of anything? Nope. Okay. Uh, roll call vote, please, Eddie. Mr. Abizé? Yes. Ms. Cardello? Yes. Maria? Yes. Ms. Lambert? Yes. Ms. Murray? Yes. Mr. Panarisi? Yes. Ms. Sarney? Yes. Mr. Parker? Yes. Eight in the affirmative, uh, motion passes. Back motion for adjournment. Mr. Mayor. Motion for adjournment. Second. And Mr. Apresay on, on the motion. 
Uh, yes, Mr. Pack. I, I just want to recognize that uh, school committee member uh, Barrows uh, did contact and then we had a call to work tonight. So they uh, call us. So. I missed 90% of what you said in terms of Mr. Barrows's, about Mr. Barrows's absence. I'll get a new Chromebook for the next meeting. Mr. Barrows has a prior commitment. Oh, okay. All right. Well, that was, that was worth waiting for to hear about Mr. Barrows's whereabouts, believe me. Uh, all right. So we had a motion from the mayor for adjournment. Was there a second? Um, second. Second. Okay. Motion made and seconded for adjournment. And uh, uh, roll call, please. Alien further, I want to thank... Uh, everybody for uh, being here and participating. Thank you. Go ahead, Addie. Ms. Abrazé? Yes. Ms. Cardello? Yes. Mayor yes. DeMaria? Yes. Lambert? Yes. Ms. Murray? Yes. Mr. Panarisi? Yes. Ms. Sarney? Yes. Mr. Parker? Yes. In the affirmative, uh, motion passed, we have adjourned. Uh, good night, everybody. Hey. Happy Memorial Day. Good night. <laughs>